everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, going to take a look at just an absolutely gorgeous 1966 Chevrolet Chevelle Malibu. Awesome car, guys. Uh, love this car. I've actually got quite a bit of history on this car. In fact, I just learned a little more. Um, originally, I bought this car from a guy to Tennessee. Uh, older man, late 70s. Uh, it's a four-speed car, and unfortunately, he had to sell this car because he was really struggling. He had some problems with his foot, and uh, he couldn't shift it anymore. Uh, but I remember when I bought this car, he actually drove this car three hours to a car show that I was at um, to sell me this car. So that's the kind of car that it is. Um, but he didn't restore it. He bought it really just like you see it. Um, a good friend of his is the one who restored the car. Unfortunately, he has passed away. Um, but great little car. But I sold the car to a buddy of mine over in Pennsylvania who's had it for a while. Um, but killer car, man. Um, the best way I can describe this car, just a good, honest, straight old car. Finished in beautiful tuxedo black paint. It's got uh, a factory black vinyl interior in it. It is a small block 350 underneath the hood with a Muncie four-speed manual transmission. And the thing that I love about this car, they kind of left it like an old school, what I call Woodward Dream, uh, Woodward Dream Cruise Coo uh, Cruiser. This car looks like it's set up to cruise Woodward Avenue and head to Tid, uh, Ted's and get a milkshake. So, great car. Um, they didn't clone it into a Super Sport, which is what 90% of these are. And I love that this car was kind of left alone and kind of has that old school flavor to it. Uh, you can nitpick it. There's a couple little things in the paint that I'll point out. Uh, little touch-up marks. Uh, but very, very nice car, man. Good, solid, straight Tennessee body. Uh, they definitely replaced the bumpers. Um, I actually don't even know how old the restoration is. I'm sure it's not very old, though. Um, but wicked cool car, man. Like I say, it's it's got slick paint on it, nice and straight down the sides. It's got 15-inch rocket chrome uh, wheels all the way around it. They've got it set up a little bit. Buddy of mine actually, uh, uh, Chuck, just put brand new air shocks on the rear. Um, matter of fact, he just put brand new X-Pipe Flowmaster dual exhaust on it too. It sounds great. Again, you can pick a couple of little touch-up marks and stuff like that, but still, very, very nice car. Hits the road great. I drove it in 80 degree heat the day that I, uh, uh, the day that I bought it. And like I say, he drove it three hours to the car show that I was at to sell it to me. A little marks in the glass, but very, very. I'm mean, looking at the paint. Car slick. and straight down the sides there was a little ah where is it i know there's a little yeah a little scratch right there but man like i say just nitpicking it that is a killer killer car I believe those are 15 by 8. Rocket wheels are definitely chrome. They've converted it to uh, front disc brakes. They left all the 327 amendments on it. Matter of fact, it's got a um, uh, 327 air cleaner uh, decal on it because that's what the car would have been. It's actually a 350 crate engine that's in there now. Uh, Holly four barrel. It's got a Wien aluminum intake, stock exhaust, uh, exhaust uh, manifolds. HI distributor, you can see the chrome air cleaner with the finned aluminum valve covers, power steering, power front disc brakes, Muncie four speed manual transmission. It's got the uh, Harrison radiator in it.
That's a good car right there. And man, turn the key and go cruise. You can uh, you can jump in this thing and just cruise down the road in it. Like I said, I love the, the look of this car. Color chrome is nice. Chrome mirror. You definitely replace those. New door rubbers. Door skins are nice and clean. Looks like new carpet, new door pads. Now this might be the original interior. I don't think that interior has been changed. It's got all the correct um, uh, Fisher body seat belts in it. Look at how nice that steering wheel is. One little mark on Look at that thing. Beautiful. It's got the correct T-handle shifter in it. Showing 24208. Guys, I do not know what the mileage is on the restoration. I'm assuming not a ton. Uh, this is an interior, your dome light, your interior light for the car. Uh, tack works. It's got the knee knocker tack, which is super cool. It's got the gauge package in it. Uh, brand new retro sounds radio. Chuck just did that. Um, again, it's got X-Pipe. Uh, Flowmaster dual exhaust with the chrome tips on it. Stock 10 bolt, doesn't have a big gear or anything like that. Definitely something you can take out and cruise on the expressway. Like I say, he was late 70s with a bad foot and drove this car three hours. That generation's a heck of a lot tougher than mine, I'll tell you that right now. There is no doubt about it. Uh, Jack with the old uh, Silvertown bias fly spare, that's pretty cool. It's all spackle coated like in the trunk. Everything opens and closes real nice. The car's clean underneath. As always, the post photos of the bottoms of all the cars. this car man I hope whoever buys this car leaves it alone man turn the key and go have fun with it I would drive the heck out of this car gauges are you de they definitely redone all that all those gauges are nice and clean then stock t-handle shift you have to pull the t-handle to get it in reverse go ahead start it Mike A little something on there. I don't know what that is. It's coming off though, guys. Again, glass is nice. Of the one little back glass had a mark in it. I seen that. That runs out great. I just trying to be too quick with the throttle because I've never heard that belt squeak so. Boy, that thing's nice. Just a little sweetheart, man. Gauges all work. Tack works. Parking brake works. Yeah, doors open and close real nice. Fit and finish is really nice on the car. Give it a little wrap, Mike. Great sound. Uh, should just be able to turn the uh, radio on. I know the blower motor works. Yep. Watch it, don't blow eardrums out. I know it works, it's brand new. Yeah, just gotta find a station on it, but yep, it works. Look at that car. Wipers. I 
last card that didn't work on the left side. I know that works. We'll check it. Again, make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram and our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page, guys. You can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video. Great way to keep track of the new stuff. I don't know how they do it, but the guys will set it up where they get a text when I post a new video. Look how straight that car is, man. Sits good. Great stance. Have a great day, guys.